sales directors here. I'm one of five total. Uh, and how I found VisiPay. So actually I met Austin well before I actually came on board with VisiPay. I actually met him two years, uh, about three months after VisiPay started. I used to help him and Melissa out with their previous business. And then he brought it up to me, kind of what he was doing and kind of where he was at. And I knew a little bit about his side of things and how he was going to get started. Two years passed and then he did ask me at that point, he was like, you know, would you think about jumping into this industry, kind of being a director side of things, and eventually help build out the sales side. Jumped right in. I uh, actually worked in tech support. Not a lot of people know about that. Almost nobody that's new knows that, that I did tech support with Kyle. And then gradually, about four or five months of that, I started to factor over to the sales side, kind of building that side out. I would say the sales is different just because I'm selling people on the dream and the freedom that you know this industry brings and kind of got along the way. You know, some days I might be a teacher, a coach, just uh, basically Google sometimes, or other days I might be a therapist. You know, we get to know our partners really well. Uh, and it comes down to, I would say the sales is a little different here because I'm more focused on that individual to really buy into how we do things. So at the end of the day is take care of merchants, do things right, and everybody make plenty of income to obviously take care of their families and, and uh, obviously income for the future to come too. It's very inclusive, uh, especially on the sales side. You know, it's like, call it the wolves of the company, but even on our end, people come in and, and everybody just becomes kind of like a, a beyond friendship, you know, family amongst each other. I would say since, um, obviously you guys will probably see the video from Jose, him and I were the first directors. Uh, we kind of, we not that we were thrown in and said, hey, good luck, pat on the back, make it happen. Uh, we kind of set the ground ship for not just training for the directorship, because sometimes the directors that we bring in will be from the field work, like many of us, but um, I would say my future plans or future excitement would be building that base and building the training as a directorship so that we can give the opportunity to individuals who may not get it at other companies because you know they don't have 20 years experience or maybe they don't you know show the company that they're applying for a you know thirty thousand dollar month residual so they say they'll never make it as a director basically just setting the groundwork for if we give somebody the opportunity they can be successful as long as they put the work in and, and grow into a career path you know in this industry.